In this section, we're going to look at my personal favourite, which happens to be stars. Not the X Factor type, but the stars in the universe. So what are stars anyway? We all see them in the night sky, but what are they and how do they all begin? Well, a star is basically like a sun. More specifically, it's a luminous ball of plasma held together by gravity that radiates heat that is generated by thermonuclear fusion in its core. So how do stars form then? Well, a star begins its life as a massive cloud of dust and gas, mainly hydrogen nuclei. Due to the gravitational attraction, the gas particles come together and eventually become so dense that it collapses. As a result, the temperature starts to increase and after a sustained period of time, the temperature is high enough for the thermonuclear reactions to occur. The nuclear fusion process involves hydrogen atoms joining together to form helium nuclei. This fusion process releases a tremendous amount of energy. As the temperature of the core of the star increases, the attractive gravitational forces balances the outward forces. The star then forms a stable shape. The star will eventually run out of a supply of hydrogen, and when this happens, the outer shell of the star expands into what is known as a red giant. The core of the star starts to cool and contract. The outer layers of the star drift away and gain heat, triggering nuclear fusion, resulting in a spectacular explosion called a supernova. The helium, oxygen, carbon, nitrogen, iron and uranium are scattered back to dust into space. This is known as a nebula. The core of the star becomes a dense and small star, known as a white dwarf. It's difficult to imagine just how big the universe is, as it's made up of billions of galaxies. Now a galaxy consists of millions of stars held together by the force of gravity. Our galaxy is called the Milky Way, not to be confused with the chocolate bar, of course. Just to give you an idea of the sheer size of the Milky Way, it's 100,000 light years in diameter, a light year being the distance that light travels in one year. 